In this segment, I'm going to discuss the Dragonfly Python-based speech recognition framework. Now that basically means that you can write your own uh, commands using the full power of the Python language, and it works with either Dragon Naturally Speaking or Windows Speech Recognition. Now for reference, I'm using uh, Dragon Naturally Speaking because I don't have Windows Vista. Now Dragonfly is extremely powerful, and in this short segment we're going to discuss only two of its features, which I consider to be, in fact, the most powerful. We're going to talk about customizable continuous command recognition, and I'm going to give you an example later, but that, what that basically means is that you can write your own individual uh, commands in Python. You can utter them separately, which means they're separated by pauses, or you can just chain them together without pauses into one long utterance. Now, just parenthetically, that's important for Dragon naturally speaking because recognition accuracy goes up the longer the utterance is. For reference, we're going to be talking about uh, about items derived from the multi-edit py script, which you can find uh, off of the repository link on the main Dragonfly web page. So let's take a quick look at that script. Now here I have the script open in my editor, and what you'll find is there's a long chain of utterances, which are these things, and they correspond to mappings, which is all of these things on the other side. So for example, if I say uh, six left, for instance, it'll hit the left key six times. So let's go ahead and just see that in action. Ten left. 10 right, 10 left, 10 right. Now, did you see I could say 10 left and it moved the cursor to the left 10, 10 spaces, and then I said 10 right separately as a separate utterance, and then I chained them together, 10 left, 10 right. It did it right off the bat. It actually will do that for any, for a very long chain of utterances, and it'll do it for anything in this list. And the reason for that is they're chained together here in a repetition class which allows me to take anything in this very long list, and my list is really long compared to the one, the one in the repository, and it'll parse, it'll parse everything itself and execute the individual actions. Now let's talk about uh, processing arbitrary text. This, ba this uh, mapping basically says that I can uh, you know, say the word dictate or, or the word say, and that ev anything I say after it, and, and I could talk for a while, is going to be captured in this text variable and then it's going to be written to the screen this way. So let's just take a quick example of that. Say I just said something. Okay, so that printed it out and that was pretty good. The real powerful part happens because anything else in that list, all those other commands, I can combine with the arbitrary uh, dictation. Let's look at an example. Shift home, say anything. Now that actually did three things. You see, there's a shift command here, right? Shift. There's a home command here, which is up here. Home. And then there was a say anything part, right? The say anything was right here. You saw me uh, utter something arbitrarily after that, so I strung together three of them in that case. Now that, I can actually string, I can actually have the say, the arbitrary utterance process anywhere in the, anywhere in the utterance. It doesn't have to come at the beginning or the end, it can be anywhere. Let me give you an example. I'm going to put it at the end and you're going to see how powerful this is. Say, I just said something back six. Do you see how it, uh, it hit backspace six times after I, uh, after I said the utterance? Which is pretty slick because it was able to separate in the say, it actually knew when my arbitrary utterance stopped, and it stopped because there was something else there, right? Sorry, there was a backspace right here. 
right here, backspace. And it, you know, it, it moved the cursor back and erased the, the text under it. So that's just a very brief discussion on some of the really powerful features of the Dragonfly uh, framework. We talked about customizable command com uh, recognition, where you can write your own commands in Python and uh, string them together in arbitrarily long utterances, or at least pretty long utterances. We talked about uh, arbitrary text processing from an utterance, where you can capture uh, arbitrary uh, text and actually process it using Python. So I hope uh, you found that informative, and I hope you check out the Dragonfly uh, framework, because it is enormously powerful. And uh, we just very, very, very lightly uh, scratch the surface in this segment.